So, Carlin. Yes. I'm getting this quite frequently. A question? Uh, a situ well, it's a situation. A woman mm -hmm. just learns to have an orgasm in her 30s or 40s. So doesn't remember masturbating as a child? She never no masturbated. Hands. No masturbation. So it's her first orgasm. Oh, she's thrilled. She's so, then a week, two weeks later, she wants to get rid of the vibrator. Well, I think it's because you're so excited that now you're at the orgasm buffet. And you're like, oh, I really like the filet mignon, but... <laughs> I'll have a hamburger. Exactly. Then I want a hot dog. <laughs> exactly. Beef stroganoff. You want to keep on going. And well, I think there's no expectation. Here's the thing. The key is for women who, haven't, who have not learned to masturbate, as children, which means they've made the connection from the clitoris to the pleasure center in the brain. It's as they're answer. developing. And they're developing. So that connection is going throughout. But if that whole thing is shut down. Or not even started. That's the whole thing. You didn't even start it. Didn't it. Even, it didn't even. You didn't get it out of the never, game. It never went online. <laughs> you didn't get out of the game. It never went online. All right. So they all want to drop the vibrator and learn to use their hands so their boyfriends or girlfriends or girlfriend can do oral or manual now the last woman that wrote that in i said i and i she said when she wrote back boy that was some tough love well because you get irritated because <laughs> you hear the same question so many times so i said here it is you're in your mid 30s you've had an, your first orgasm and the first thing you want to do is get rid of the vibrator <laughs> so some jackass can give you your orgasm does that make any sense so i gave her the second round i said okay here's some here's some soft love Yes, it is possible to get rid of the vibrator. Of course it's possible. It's your body. It's like you can get used to anything. You can create a routine. You can, you know. Don't plan on it. I'm sorry. Well, it takes a long time. So you were saying it takes. It would take about a year. Or longer. Or longer. And during that period, they have to go without orgasms. You cannot pick up your vibrator every now and then just to, you know, get it. You have to get. But why? Oh, you have to get totally off the vibrator. It has to leave your up, leave your house. It because if it's somewhere in the if you got it up in the closet, one night you're going to be horny and you'll go up in the closet and you'll. Of course get it. you would. Or you'll be. Of course the, you would. You'll be humping the washing machine <laughs> on the spin cycle. You got it. So you're saying if if something works, why not stick with it? But if you want to change it, of course you can. Why can't? Why can't she incorporate the vibrator into her partner sex? I mean, you know... You know, like, you can. I think that, though, you want to be able to say that you can do it manually. I, I think it, it becomes... Because you did miss out, and you know you have. So it's like you want to go back. I couldn't. I couldn't go back. And I started off at five manual. Well, I think at certain ages. I know right after birth... Oh, I needed the Hitachi because I had gotten down to the We Vibe Tango, that little vibrator with my partner. So I just needed, and but after birth and right before, we had sex like two days before I went into labor, and I had to use the Hitachi because I didn't feel anything because there's so much pressure. Like you can feel the head on your cervix. So it's like to get myself to the point of orgasm, I really needed so stimulation. I have a whole book called Orgasms for Two that gives you all of this information. Mm -hmm. Take the vibrator to bed. If men have a preference that they want to use our vagina, my preference is I want to use my vibrator. Why can't we see it as a preference? It could be a preference. And if you if you want to go about it, it's going to be a long, arduous. It's like if, you know, you're 100 pounds overweight, you're not going to lose that weight in a week. It's like anything in life. It's going to take commitment okay, here's, and diligence. Here's what happens over and over again. I hear this. They start. Uh, several weeks in, a month, two months, then they're sneaking, you know. Of course. Now, now they're on their electric toothbrush. <laughs> but I think it would be great to do what you always advise women to do. Start with a vulva massage with oil. Feel the good feelings. And always start with there and end with the vibrator. You know, and start feeling. You've got to get in touch with your body. Oh, always start with your hands. Yes, absolutely. But, I I mean, I, what it still, it irritates Well, because it's, it's youth. It's an exclusive. It's either or instead of being both. Why can't you use hands, tongues, and vibrators? 
and penises and dildos and why can't we have it all? Uh, well, you can. Because I do. Do you, you have it all? No, absolutely <laughs> no. not. Absolutely not. You don't have no. dildos? I have dildos. I can't come from clit stim manual or no. Girl. Well, because it's an 87 year old clit. Come on. We need to, like. It knows what it wants. <laughs> I'm just, once again, I am supporting women to bring the vibrator to bed. There is nothing wrong with having the vibrator. So many women do. You know, I, I think it's a it's a myth that we don't. I have <laughs> incredible sex, partner sex, for 10 years with Eric, and I had my vibrator with me every time. It never bothered him. He feels the vibes. So are you saying we shouldn't rank orgasms? Oh. Is that what maybe is the problem that we want? We think that one my, is better than the other? <laughs> my, my vibrator orgasm isn't isn't as powerful as his manual on me or his oral doing me. Yeah. I say it's protecting the male ego, that's what I say. Well, what, but in the lesbian community, they have the same kind of prohibition against vibrators too, so it's not just men. I, I think it's just one of those social things that we don't want accoutrements so and we feel like we're less, you know. Sisters, get ready, the next level is coming in. Artificial intelligence. Oh, I can't AI. wait to have my AI vibrator. Oh, oh orgasmatron. It'll be hugging you. It'll be doing your nipples. It'll be doing your. You can program bubble. it to oh. do it whatever you want. Oh, oh. oh, say whatever you want. Uh, sign me up. We give you permission to come any way you want to come. And remember, there is no one right way to have an orgasm. However, you get off is wonderful. So just enjoy it.